Unfortunately, if you are using the mobile app for Google Slides, you cannot change the size of the slide within the app. Instead, we have to open up a web browser, such as Safari, which I've opened up right here. Within Safari, you're going to go to the address slides.google.com and it's going to take you to your slides and at that point it might prompt you to move over to the mobile app. In that case say no I'm not interested stay here. We're going to make a new blank presentation. You can choose a, a theme if you would like. You can give it a title. And then once you've given it a title, the next thing you're going to want to do before you really start editing this is go to File, Page Setup, and change it from widescreen to custom, and then change it to the size of a letter piece of paper, which is 8.5 by 11. We'll keep it landscape and we'll make it 11 by 8.5. We'll apply that. Now at this point you can continue editing using all of these great features right within the browser, which is what I would recommend. But if you really want to use the mobile version, the iPad version of this app, then you can go home and you can find the Slides app. And then you can locate the one that you just created here and open it up. You can continue editing here and you're all good to go and it will stay the right size when you go to print it.